Real Fan Opinions brought to you by Wash and Go. How are we doing guys? Welcome to UFF Daily. So the first place we're going to start is the Champions League and Celtic because they crashed out last night to AEK Athens. And um, Celtic fans are not happy and they are demanding that Brendan Rodgers is sacked. I think that's a little bit premature and um, maybe a little bit, you know, um, not what they really want because I can't see anyone doing a better job than him, to be honest. Now, I know the season hasn't got off to the greatest of starts. They, of course, lost at the weekend to Hearts and now they're out of the Champions League. So it's not good. They drew the first leg 1-1 and then they went out last night in Greece losing 2-1 and... You know, Celtic, they need to be getting into the group stages. And I suppose maybe it raises the question, should they be coming and playing more competitively and going into the English leagues? You look at um, sides like Cardiff and Swansea um, based in Wales and they're playing in the English league. So why can't the Scottish leagues? Um, but yeah, I don't think that one's going to happen anytime soon. But of course, it does raise the question. Um, but yeah, Celtic fans, they are not happy. They are out of the Champions League and they are calling for Brendan Rodgers' head. A uh, piece of transfer news involves Chelsea and that's one of their signings from last year, Bapayoko. Um, he has gone to AC Milan on a loan deal with the option to buy. So um, yeah, he didn't have the greatest of years last season um, at Chelsea and it looks like they're trying to cash in and get a bit of money back. So he's on loan at um, AC Milan and it'd be interesting to see how he does there this year. Last piece of news um, involves Arsenal and Leroy Rossini has come out and defended Unai Emery and said that criticism of him is uncalled for. He says it's disrespectful, the man's won three Europa Leagues in a row, won titles and whatnot at PSG and you can see what he wants to try and do at Arsenal and to sit there and criticise him after one game after losing to the best team in the country, Man City, is wrong. It's completely out of order and it's disrespectful and I agree with him. I've said it, I've spoke about this, you've got to give Unai Emery time. You can see what he's trying to implement. There were bits and pieces in that game that I looked at and I went, yeah, I can see what's going on here. But people just won't seem to give him the time, but I will anyway. And um, yeah, Leroy Rossini has come out, defended him and um, said that, you know, we need to give him that time and to sit there and question him after one game and what he's done for the last five weeks or so in training is just disrespectful. So yeah, like I said, I agree. So that is it for today's UFF Daily. I will be back tomorrow. I'll see you lot then. I'm out of here.